appreciate it. So today we are going to be talking about the best brokerages for retirement. And that's what the question mark. Yes, you can add whatever uh, brokers you would like to this list. And before we get started, let me go ahead and, and say this right out the gate. There are more great retirement accounts out there. Uh, I would say Robinhood is is one. They give you a match if you open up a, a, a Roth IRA. You can also uh, bring your pull your funds from from. Let's say you you got a four hundred one k that you have just sitting there. You can always roll that over to a, a brokerage like Robinhood, uh, and they'll also give you guys a match. Also, you got Webull. Webull is another one that's a little bit newer as well. They have great incentives. So just to name those those two, just to get that out there. Okay, so I wanted to let you guys know that. Now, the reason why I have the brokerages on this list is because they're excellent. They've been around a while, majority of them. And they're some of the most reliable brokerages around, okay? And so that's going to lead us to the first one, which is Fidelity. Now, the thing about Fidelity is they offer a wide range of retirement accounts, including traditional IRAs, Roth IRAs, uh, SEP IRAs, and 401k rollovers. So, you know, not all of the brokerages are going to, you know, give you the incentive to be able to do that or give you a variety of different options that you can really use for whatever kind of account that you would like, right? So also with them, you have $0 commission fees on stock and ETF trade. So if you're a person that likes to trade a little bit more, this could be more of an incentive to you because you kind of have that, that, that free will to kind of do as you please, right? So, but... Honestly, guys, when it comes to uh, brokerages, right, you really want it really doesn't matter which one you go with, but you have to think a little bit more long term. If you get into this trade, trade, trade type of mindset, you know, that can obviously hinder your your progress as you get into retirement age. So you just want to be kind of careful with that. Now. There are some people for tax reasons that use, let's say, a Roth IRA to <laughs> maximize on, on their taxes, but that, that's a whole nother story for another day. Maybe we'll talk about that in another video. Now, another thing about Fidelity is it provides excellent research tools, educational resources, and responsive customer service. Now, a lot of times with these brokerages, you know, the customer service historically hasn't been the greatest, but to have a brokerage that's responsive, have a brokerage you can rely on and get answers pretty much whenever you need it, that that that's, that takes you a long way. Believe me, it takes you a long way. Now, the features are zero, uh, several zero free and low cost index funds, making it easy for long-term investors to maximize costs. And then this particular brokerage is going to be best for investors seeking a full-service brokerage with comprehensive retirement planning tools and investment options. So if that's something that kind of, you know, is is, is eye-opening to you, then that may be something you may want to look into, okay? Now, next, we have Charles Schwab. And Charles Schwab offers a variety of retirement accounts, including IRAs and 401k rollovers, along with commission-free stock and ETF trade. So you're starting to see this, this pattern of these brokerages giving you commission-free uh, stock and ETF trades. And one thing I would like to say is the brokerage Robinhood also kind of changed the game with these uh, free trades. And so in order for these brokerages to kind of compete with what's going on, which obviously benefits us, is these free trades. So thank you, Robin Hood, for bringing that forth. 
Um, but you know, brokerages are still making a lot of money in, in several different rate ways, especially as it pertains to options trading. So this is one of the reasons why options trading is pushed so heavily so they can go ahead and make money off of you that way. Okay. Now, uh, Schwab Intelligence Portfolios is a robo-advisor solution, making it a great option for hands-off investors. So if you're uh, hands-off, you don't really want to get into the, the nooks and crannies of every single thing, then this could potentially be a, a, a good move for you to actually look into, okay? And Charles Schwab is also known for his exceptional customer service and essential educational resources, ideal for beginner and experienced investors. Now, no account minimums and no fees for IRA accounts, making it accessible for new investors. So again, if you're a person that's starting from ground zero and you don't want to be penalized with this whole minimum fiasco thing, then it may be something that you may want to look into. Okay. So just, just as a, a reminder, okay, let me zoom this in for you guys a little bit more. There we go. Now, the, this particular brokerage is best for investors who want robust research tools, a user-friendly platform, and various investment products for retirements. So if there's something that uh, you potentially want on your radar, I would, I would, you know, look into it. I can't recommend anything, but, you know, it's something to look into. Next on the list is Vanguard. Uh, for known for the ticket symbol V O O V T I, you know, and the the list goes on and on. So when you think about some of the better ETFs out there, Vanguard definitely has that uh, in the bag. Now Vanguard is well known for its low cost mutual funds, index funds, and ETFs, making it ideal for long term buy and hold investors. So they have no commissions on Vanguard mutual funds and ETFs helping investors reduce trading costs and focus on long-term growth. Now, strong emphasis on long-term, low-cost investing, which aligns well with retirement account strategies. So this is one of the reasons why a lot of investors go with Vanguard because they're thinking long-term. Now, we know this short-term thing is starting to become uh, a newer side of the spectrum. So, you know, long term, they say time in the market beats time in the market. So, you know, hey, it, it is what it is, but there's a bunch of different ways you guys can make money out there. Now, it also offers a wide variety of retirement accounts, including IRAs, uh, SEP IRAs, and 401k rollovers. Um, and they're best for a long term buy and hold investors looking to maximize fees and focus on retirement growth. Now, next we have E-Trade. And so E-Trade offers commission-free stock and ETF trades along with a wide range of retirement accounts. Uh, their advanced trading platforms are available, which are ideal for more active traders managing both retirement and non-retirement accounts. So they got to throw that in there. So, you know, traditionally, I would say a lot of these trading platforms obviously are going to be known for traders, but to get more investors in there, they're going to give you incentives to be an investor, right? There's all these brokerages that focus on trading, trading, trading. You know, fees on the options, fees on this, fees on that. Um, but hey, us long term investors, we want to have incentives too. Now, uh, e trade provides a wide range of tools, including retirement calculators, which is good, right? Thumbs up on that. Uh, financial planning resources, uh, and making it easy to plan for the future. So, if you want to get a visual, of what the future could potentially hold for your retirement, these types of tools that they offer are going to probably be ideal for those of you that are really uh, enthused about seeing that. Okay. Now, 
E-Trade is best for active investors or those who want both long-term retirement savings and short-term trading opportunities, okay? So let's move on to the next one. So the next one we have is Merrill Edge, been around for a while. Uh, Commission-free stock and ETF traders making an affordable option for building a retirement portfolio. Uh, they're known for their excellent research tools, educational content, and robust customer support for retirement planning. Now, offers seamless integration with Bank of America accounts, providing additional perks such as rewards and account management features. So if you guys have a Bank of America bank account, could be something that you want to potentially look into. And now this brokerage is best for Bank of America customers and investors who want strong integration between their banking and retirement accounts. Okay. Now let's let's well, let me go back. Sorry. Oh, back back. So next is TD Ameritrade, and so we know they they recently were were bought out. Um, I think it was from Charles Schwab. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but. Uh, TD Ameritrade features one of the best trading platforms suitable for active investors who want to manage both retirement and non-retirement trades. And so just because I believe they were bought out by Charles Schwab, we're going to have to take into account all of these features rolled over to uh, Charles Schwab. Now, they have no commission fees on stock and ETF trades. Here we go again and then making it a cost-effective option for building a retirement portfolio. Now, offers a variety of retirement planning tools, educational resources, and no account minimums, making it accessible for all investors. Now, they are best for investors who want long-term retirement savings options with the flexibility of active trading, okay? Next, we've got Alley Invest. And so they are low cost IRA accounts. Uh, so I'm sorry, they have low cost IRA accounts with commission free stock and ETF trades. There we go again. And they're a simple and easy to use platform, especially for allied bank customers who want to integrate banking and investing in one. And so since we brought out Ally guys, there's also uh, SoFi you guys can look into. So SoFi is one of the hottest stocks out there. Uh, they're good. They're good for banking. They're good for loans. And then they've got a platform also for uh, for retirement. So could potentially be something you guys may want to look into as well. Now, uh, Ally offers both self-directed trading and robo advisory services for a hands-off approach. Okay. Now, this is best for Ally Bank customers or investors looking for a simple, low-cost brokerage to manage their retirement savings, okay? And now, we've got Wealthfront Robo Advisor. And now, this is an automated portfolio management focused on low-cost index funds with tax loss harvesting and automatic rebalancing. Now, they have low management fees of 0.25% per year, making it an affordable option for hands-off investors, okay? So listen, guys, everybody's got to get paid. Uh, the financial advisors have to get paid. The portfolio managers have to get paid. And just for 2.5%, which is not much, you know, hey, these companies have to get paid one way or another. Now, with Wealthfront, it requires a minimum investment of $500, which is one of the only downsides, making it accessible for new investors with smaller amounts of capital. Now, this is best for hands-off investors looking for a robo-advisor to manage their retirement portfolio with minimum fees, okay? So this was the last one on the list. Like I said, there are a lot of di different accounts out there. Uh, I mentioned Robinhood, Rebo has one, uh, SoFi has one. Uh, I mean, the list goes on and on. We'll, we'll be bringing you guys more accounts, but I kind of wanted to bring this one to the table first because these are some of the more established, well-known brokerages. And so I wanted to bring you guys um, 
I'm not going to say brokerages that are going to be around forever because we, we just never know what's going to happen. But at the same time, these are the most reliable uh, sources that you can use for retirement. OK, also look into some of the big banks like uh, Bank of America, for example, has this thing going on. Uh, with uh, Merrill Edge, we spoke about it in this particular video, but I know Chase has one, right? I've got a, a Roth IRA with, with Chase. I've got, you know, uh, a 401k. I've got, you know, other Roth IRAs as well. And so as long as you uh, meet that, that, that threshold or don't go beyond what the, the max is, then everything will be fine, okay? So listen, guys, I appreciate you guys for being here. Please hit that thumbs up as we continue to grow the channel. That is my one-year-old interrupting the video. I appreciate you guys, and I'm out. Peace.